All right, guys, let's talk about um, the AMC report card. Now, the AMC report card is a kind of little hidden report. Um, we just kind of label it as report card. Um, that, let's jump into our product here, and then let's jump into our competitor builder. Um, again, we have it filtered towards our accepted. Um, if you don't know how to clean up the list, please head on over to the overview video on how to clean up your list. Um, but essentially, the AMC report card is right over here on the right-hand side. What we are doing is asking Amazon to please describe back to us um, that particular competitor's listing. It's You can kind of think of it like a reverse ASIN where um, you're, you're giving an ASIN and getting keywords back um, in that terms, but it's not a reverse ASIN. This is strictly Amazon, here is an ASIN. Please describe back to me this ASIN. So it's kind of like similar, like if you were to describe a painting or an image, right? So if you ask Amazon, Amazon, please, or Google, Google, describe back to me this image. And it may say, okay, there's there's a mountain, there's trees, there's a river. And as you begin to describe the, the, the painting or picture, you realize it's Yosemite in California. Very similar. Uh, we're going to ask Amazon to take this ASIN and describe back to us that product in order to make that happen. We just have to hit this little uh, spyglass, go ahead and let it run, and it should take anywhere from three to five seconds, sometimes longer. And there you go, that was under three seconds. From there, I can go ahead and click on the timestamp. So when I click on the timestamp, I'm going to get the keywords that make up this listing. Sometimes they're long, sometimes they're short. From there, I can go ahead and either copy all and copy it to my clipboard, utilize it in uh, maybe another piece of software or another sheet that I'm keeping track of. But in this instance, I'm going to add it to my product. I'm going to click add, and there we go. So now I just, I have some really cool keywords I've never seen before, okay? So a couple of them I don't like. Keychain, my product definitely is, not, this This keyword is a little too vague. It's, it's too loose, so I'm gonna go ahead and delete it. Uh, ring, definitely another one. All right, uh, my product is not a key ring, so I'm gonna go ahead and delete those as well. Uh, key ring uh, lobster claw, now my product is a lobster claw, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep those. A key clip I do not like, a key chain clip, I like that one. So these are the ones I do like. I'm gonna go ahead and hit next, go through the cleaner process and look at that. All of these decisions that I made before, not at the phrase level, but at the, at the word level. Right, so I've already made the decision that I like lobster, I like claw, and I like clasp. So I have no decisions to make. How awesome is that? I'm gonna go ahead and finish. And now I just added more keywords uh, to my listing, or excuse me, to my manager. I can go back to my competitor builder and run it again. Let's just say I wanna do this one here, uh, this swivel hooks clips. I can hit the button, go ahead and let it run. Go ahead and click on the timestamp. And again, I have even more here. Now this one has a lot more keywords. As you can see, has a lot more keywords uh, than the previous one. I'm gonna go ahead and add in my product. From there, I'm gonna clean it up again. Uh, some of these I do not like. Um, you know, I don't even wanna make judgments on, on kind of some of these. I don't even wanna make some judgment calls. There we go. So I like these, I'm gonna go ahead and hit next. And there we go. So it's going to go ahead and check the index uh, of these keyword phrases against my listing to see if I'm indexed for these. Um, and then from there, I'm going to go ahead and make the decisions left or right. Um, as you can see, I do have some previous decisions, decisions already made for me. Uh, four of them are going to be uh, archived since I've said that I do not like these keywords. 32 are automatically in my list and one will automatically um, be added to my list since I've already made the decisions and then from here I'll make the rest of the decisions for the brevity of this video I'm just gonna move them over to the left and hit finish and all these keywords are now in my keyword manager so that's the power of the competitor builder um, this one I'd like to run on my major major competitors maybe um, once or once a month or so to get to see if I can get any more keyword ideas you definitely can run it against your own products. If you don't see your own product, you can go ahead and click on add related products, add your ASIN, and then you can go ahead and run both features on your particular product. So hopefully that makes sense. Um, I think this is a really cool feature. 
um, because it, the data comes directly from Amazon. It's not a report that we're generating. It's not a reverse ASIN. Uh, this is coming directly from Amazon. So I hope, I hope you guys like this feature. I think we're the only people that have this feature um, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks guys.